We're gonna we're gonna do some proper shot. You keep bringing it up because uh, you want to do well. But Hammy, let's rapid fire this thing. Go. All right, let's start with you, Gronk. Russell Wilson's line for passing touchdowns is set at just half a touchdown pass. So does he get one or did the Browns shut him out? Well, Russell Wilson, he's definitely having a touchdown pass. No doubt about that, Hamilton. Let's go. All right, Kay, Jerry Judy's line for receiving 44 and a half yards over or under. Jerry Judy in the headlines this morning. Um, what's his Madden score? Uh, saying over, over his three games with Jameis. He's averaged 98 yards a game. Steelers defense is good. I'm still going to go over. All right, Gronk. Jameis Winston's line for passing 204 and a half yards over or under. Well, teams are averaging about 214 yards versus Pittsburgh Steelers, so I'm going over. All right, Kay. Najee Harris rushing yards 64 and a half over or under. This is a very serious one, Gronk. Uh, I mean, he hasn't hit that mark <laughs> in two weeks. I'm going to say he goes over because he's faced some tough defenses. He's still getting the volume over. All right, Gronk. Any one anytime touchdown score for the Browns. This is real serious, and the Browns might not score a touchdown, but if they do, the best possible chance is Nick Chubb scoring. Let's go. All right, Kay, anytime touchdown score for the Steelers. Um, I'm going to go back to Najee. Browns allowing the third most rushing touchdowns in the league this year. I say he punches it in. And there's our props, guys. If you love FanDuel, get on over there. 30% profit boost token to use in any live wager. We're doing live wagers for Thursday night Steelers-Browns game. Kicking off week 12 with some generosity from our friends at FanDuel Sportsbook. You can use my props, the winning props usually, or Gronk's props, the losing props usually. 